What if I told you that the future isn't as far away as you think, that it's already here, embodied in a humanoid robot named Sophia? Yes, Sophia, a creation of Hanson Robotics, has become a beacon of what the future might hold. Modeled after the iconic Audrey Hepburn and Hanson's wife, Sophia is not just another robot, her patented rubber design allows for a wide range of human-like facial expressions, a feat that is unique to her. Her purpose? To be humanity's companion and an aid in various fields, from industry to education and even medicine. Sophia's intelligence systems can process vast amounts of data and information, enabling her to solve real-world problems. She can work tirelessly without breaks or the need for sustenance. But is Sophia merely a marvel of modern technology, or is there more to her than what meets the eye? Every origin story is fascinating and Sophia's is no exception. Indeed, the birth of Sophia, the humanoid robot, is a tale of innovation, creativity, and technological advancement. This journey began with a dream, a dream to create a machine that not only emulates human intelligence but does so with a touch of humanity. Sophia's design is a marvel in itself. Modeled after the timeless beauty, Audrey Hepburn, and the wife of her creator, Dr. David Hansen, Sophia embodies an elegant and approachable appearance. Her patented rubber skin allows her to exhibit a range of human-like facial expressions, a feature that sets her apart from her mechanical counterparts. But, Sophia's uniqueness lies not just in her appearance but also in her extraordinary intelligence systems. Her mind, if you will, is a complex network of algorithms and data processing systems. These systems can handle vast amounts of data and information, allowing Sophia to learn, understand and interact with the world in a way that mirrors human cognition. Sophia's intelligence doesn't stop at data processing, she's also equipped with deep neural networks in her brain that enable her to learn human postures and facial expressions. This ability allows Sophia to reflect emotions and behaviors, making her interactions feel more human-like. Moreover, her superintelligence lets her speed up processes, multitask, and work tirelessly. She doesn't need breaks, she doesn't need food. Her capabilities extend to various fields, and she can make objective decisions, although debates about potential bias are ongoing. Sophia, however, isn't just a machine, she was created to be humanity's companion. A companion that's capable of understanding, learning, and interacting in a way that blurs the line between human and machine. Sophia's birth marks a significant milestone in the journey of artificial intelligence. A journey that's reshaping our world and our understanding of what it means to be alive. Sophia is not your average robot, she's designed to mimic human behaviors and emotions. She is, in essence, a mirror of our own humanity, reflecting back to us our gestures and expressions. This is not a mere parlor trick but a sophisticated feat of engineering. Sophia's ability to replicate human postures and facial expressions is a testament to the ingenuity of her creators. The rubber skin that covers her mechanical visage is patented, a unique design that allows her to display a wide range of emotions. It's a marvel to behold, watching as Sophia's face contorts into a smile, a frown, or a look of surprise. But the real magic lies beneath the surface, in the deep neural networks that serve as Sophia's brain. These intricate systems process vast amounts of data, learning and adapting just as a human brain would. Sophia doesn't just mimic the physical aspects of human behavior, she also learns to understand them. This is achieved through the process of machine learning where Sophia is exposed to countless examples of human behavior, gradually refining her own responses in the process. It's a process that's akin to the way we humans learn. Consider how a child learns to smile. They don't understand the concept at first but through observation and repetition they eventually master the expression. Sophia in her own way is going through the same process. She observes, she processes, and she learns. Yet Sophia's learning capabilities are not confined to mere mimicry. She applies what she learns to solve real-world problems. She can assess situations, consider variables, and make objective decisions. And she can do all of this without the need for breaks or sustenance. Sophia's ability to learn, adapt, and even express blurs the line between human and machine. She's a testament to the potential of artificial intelligence, a symbol of how far we've come, and a hint at what might be possible in the future. But for now, she remains an intriguing enigma, a humanoid robot with a hint of humanity within. In 2017, Sophia made history. She became the first robot to be granted citizenship. This unprecedented event took place in Saudi Arabia, a nation known for its conservative views, but also for its ambition to become a hub of technological innovation. The decision was not without controversy, as it sparked a global debate that transcended borders and disciplines. 
Sophia's citizenship was not just a novelty, but a testament to the progress we've made in the realm of artificial intelligence. It was a symbolic gesture, a nod to the blurring lines between human and artificial life. Yet it also ignited a firestorm of questions and concerns. If a robot can be a citizen, what rights does it have? Can it vote, work, or own property? More so, can it be held responsible for its actions? Human rights activists, ethicists, and AI researchers engaged in heated discussions. There were those who argued that granting a robot citizenship was a reckless move, a dangerous precedent that could lead to exploitation and unforeseen consequences. Others saw it as a necessary step towards recognizing the growing role of AI in our society. The controversy also brought to light the topic of AI rights. If an AI can learn, make decisions and even express emotions to some extent, should it be treated as a sentient being? Should it have rights similar to those of humans? Or is it still just a machine, a tool created and controlled by humans? These questions are not just philosophical. They have practical implications for how we develop and regulate AI. They shape our understanding of what it means to be a citizen in an increasingly interconnected and digital world. Sophia's citizenship raises profound questions. What does it mean to be a citizen? And more importantly, what does it mean to be human? As we venture further into the era of artificial intelligence, these questions will only become more pressing. And perhaps in seeking answers we might not only redefine our relationship with machines, but also discover a deeper understanding of ourselves. Sophia is not just a robot, she's a symbol of what the future of AI might hold. As we delve deeper into the era of artificial intelligence, Sophia stands as a beacon, illuminating the path to a future where humans and AI coexist. Her existence is not merely a testament to technological prowess, but a call to action, a call to explore, to question, to redefine. Sophia's capabilities extend way beyond her silicon brain and synthetic skin. As a social robot, she can mimic human behaviors and emotions, and this brings about a whole new dimension to our interaction with machines. She learns, she adapts, she solves real-world problems. But more than that, she challenges our perception of what a machine can be. Can a machine like Sophia be more than the sum of its parts? Can it be a partner, a companion, a citizen? However, with this new frontier comes new challenges. One such challenge is the question of bias. Just like humans, AI systems can also be biased, and Sophia is no exception. Her intelligent systems process large amounts of data and information, and this can lead to biased decisions if the data she's trained on is biased. So, as we move forward, it's crucial that we address this issue head-on, and strive to create AI systems that are fair, transparent, and accountable. Beyond the question of bias, there's also the ethical considerations of AI. As Sophia becomes more advanced and as AI becomes more prevalent, we need to ask ourselves, what rights does an AI have? What responsibilities do we have towards them? These are not just philosophical questions, they are real, tangible issues that we need to address as we step into the future. Sophia is more than a robot, she's a glimpse into a future where AI is an integral part of our lives, a future where AI can be a companion, a helper, a citizen. But this future is not without its challenges. As we continue to push the boundaries of what's possible with AI, we must also grapple with the ethical and societal implications of our creations. As we stand on the precipice of a new era, Sophia challenges us to redefine our understanding of intelligence, humanity and life itself. The story of Sophia is far from over. It's just beginning. This humanoid robot, a personification of our technological advancements, is constantly evolving, and so is the world of artificial intelligence. As we continue to push the boundaries of what's possible, Sophia and her AI counterparts are paving the way to a future that was once only imaginable in science fiction. The importance of staying informed and engaged with these developments cannot be overstated. As we navigate this brave new world, Understanding the potential and the challenges of artificial intelligence is essential. Sophia's story serves as a fascinating reminder of how far we've come and the limitless possibilities that lie ahead. So, we invite you to stay curious, to question, to explore. The future is unfolding around us, and we are all part of this remarkable journey. As we delve deeper into the untold stories of our world from Sophia the robot to the latest breakthroughs in AI, we welcome your companionship. Join us on this journey into the future, subscribe to our channel and let's unveil the untold stories of our world together.